this is my logo and first of all I want to thank everybody or all of my subscribers for subscribing to my channel I've never have dreamed that I would actually reach 200 subscribers just by you know showing gameplay and doing what I actually like to do um, yeah and I thought I would uh, try and do a video with commentary maybe um, uh, excuse me for maybe also for my my English I'm not a native speaker I'm from Switzerland so uh, it's, <laughs> it's a little bit shaky sometimes but I'll try I want to show you my newest um, tank that I've got, that's the uh, WZ-132, the tier 8 um, uh, tank. I've got it unlocked until uh, the first gun, the 100mm, and this is already a really, really fine gun. Um, the Alpha is very good, I think the gun handling with uh, with the update, with the 42 update for uh, light tanks is really good, and just the tank just feels good. And um, if you would uh, compare it to the, to the top, uh, gun, I think just the accuracy gets a little bit better, you get a higher DPM and the view range with the, with the turret um, it's it's actually 380 instead of 370 meters but on this tank, even if I've only got 370 meters of view range um, I've got a fairly good skill for a light crew with both uh, view skills, with um, camouflage and um, yeah, just the, the shooting and the, the skills that are uh, making actually the dispersion better while driving and um, that's already enough to, to have some really good games and fun in light tanks. Now this is a tier 8 game, perfectly fine for this tank. Um, I know that the like which is pushing up will get uh, the, the first spots because he's got 400 meters of view range, he'll definitely play get the spotting damage so I'm just going into a position where I think I could sneak in some shots and uh, this can is perfectly uh, fit for that some side shots I will go through most of the of the tier 8 or tier 9 sides of the of the tank and you've also got APCR with 240 pen on this gun that's it's it's enough you don't need actually more so, here up and I know that the heavies won't spot me if they get here normally or maybe a, a tiger with a good crew could could spot me or a e75 but just trying to get some some <coughs> some damage okay now they come and I'm just staying here we've lost the lichen which is basically um it's to happen almost on that position and I just right here <laughs> to, get, to get shots in. Was very pretty lucky that um, the blind shot at me uh, went over my my tower or just scratched my tower. Um, Prince repeats. As soon as I'm mount spotted, I'm going in front, trying to sneak in a shot. Hopefully, stay unspotted until my shot is yeah. Just tracked him, but that's okay. Um, if somebody hits him, then I'll get tracking damage, which would be good for the ops. And here they should they're nicely shown the sides. Of the I can track them or I can make damage if I'm lucky. Just keep on shooting at these two guys because <coughs> as you can see we're in a, a, a tier 9 lobby and I'm a tier 8 uh, tank. If I can bind these tier 9s here, two of them, then that's good. Then it's good for our team, they can do help and can do damage and they're not doing any, uh, any damage to other, other tanks of our team. Just keep on spotting sneaking some shots. As soon as I'm open, I'm, I'm going backwards. Now, um, I kind of didn't see this coming at the moment, but I'll get a surprise here. I'm not even sure, yeah, here he comes. Tier 9, um, lightweight, and of course he sees a tier 8 and thinks, uh, I have to get them, and I know this <laughs> this guy will possibly push up again because he's staying here. Means if you're unspotted, you shouldn't push up at the same spot again, and not if you one shot as this guy, which is good for us. Get the kill on him. Um, that's also good. Always try to take out the, the higher tier tanks. We'll help your team help the team win and um, as you can see we also have a little bit of lag here unfortunately since the update so now um, the T-9 
team the, the team looks even with six to six and it looks like we've got bet or the our top tiers are still here and we can slowly start to clean up the team as they have three RTs. Oops. Without driving into the stone maybe. Yeah. <laughs> um I totally forgot to fix a driver, as you can see, that's why this the tank is slow. But it's it's okay, it's it's even playable like this with the damaged engine. Not very fast, but still fast as a medium. And here I try to do maybe get some side shots from here, but as I can see I can't see anything. And I luckily also don't drop down the bridge, <laughs> which could also happen. I tried now to go up to the tank destroyer and sneak in some shots from behind. He will be facing the, the AMX, I guess. And as you can see, the, the gun is perfectly fine, also with 0.42 accuracy. You can, you can also hit exactly the same as any other gun. I think it mostly mostly accuracy is a little bit overrated, or it doesn't it doesn't really matter that much for an, also in a light tank. Here we just we just do a little bit of clean up, get some shots in, some tracking damage, and then I load a, an HE for the RT, but. It's a little bit. Uh, it's not a good decision because it's a it's a bad chat and uh, possibly as you can see it's yellow. I will hit the tracks if I shoot. But yeah, one, three, uh, five. I would have taken him out with a with a normal shot. So, but it's okay. That was a uh, an okay battle and um, of course it's almost a stock tank, but it's still it's really nice to play and I would recommend it to somebody which like that likes lights. So, thank you very much for. Um, subscribing for watching my my clips and i hope you can enjoy some of them and um yeah have a nice day thank you very much bye bye